All right, Sadhguru. An epidemic in today's world is PUBG. Do you play PUBG? Oh, I never heard this till the Prime Minister mentioned it three days ago, so… <laughs> so, uh, so my… I heard that it's some kind of a war game, is it? Yes, it is, it is. Okay. So a lot of my friends would rather play PUBG than have a conversation with me. That speaks a little about myself maybe, but they do, they want to play PUBG more. And uh, with violence being its main premise and the amount of screen time on PUBG, what do you think the impact of PUBG is on today's youth psyche and all its users? Well, how do you think, where is it leading us? See, if somebody played some game just for fun a little while, that's not an issue for me. But I hear, uh, I don't know what's the statistics in India. In United States, they're saying between eighteen to twenty-six years of age, on an average, most people are spending four and a half to six hours on these games. I think uh, we are out to produce a dumb generation. <laughs> yes, if you feel heroic by shooting down some animated pictures, phone screen is it? Yes. Huh? On the phone, phone or screen. the bigger screen? Phone screen. Phone screen. I don't think that's heroic. <laughs> it's just stupid. <laughs> just playing something for fun is different. You can play for some time, anybody can play any game they want, it's okay. But all your life, somebody is just playing this, somebody is just playing that, I think you're trying to find some substance, a substance that you don't have. You want to be a warrior without having the courage to shed your own blood. <laughs> War is not about shedding other people's blood. You are willing to shed yours, that's why you are there. Hmm? Not that you want to, you're willing. That's what makes a war hero so different because he went there willing to shed his own life. Maybe he came back, but he's willing to shed, not on a phone, 